All right, so it's early morning as y'all can see. Well, you don't know it's early. It's either early morning or late afternoon, which is, you don't know. <laughs> I can promise you, I ain't gonna be here in late afternoon and be this chipper on the camera. Uh, anyway, Skitter 620. Uh, got some road work to go touch up with this thing to get into the last patch of uh, thinning on this block here. So we got some, some blade work to do and uh, we're gonna take y'all along the ride and watch it, see what happens. Biggest 
reason these roads in here are struggling, the, the biggest reason is, I don't know, five years, six years ago, something like that, they come in here, because this is the, the West Bay hunting game, you know, it's a, it's a deer management area is what it is, it's, a, it's, it's like a state hunting reserve thing, but anyway, they come in here loose dirt back up in these roads and build their roads up real high because they had a lot of problems with the roads going underwater but even though they would go underwater you could still use them because they had hard rock pan underneath it and they, I don't know why they decided that that wasn't what they wanted so they come in here and pulled all the roads up real nice. They looked amazing. And then they growed over with grass and there was no truck traffic on them for a few years. And then the roads just, what I call, they, they rottened on themselves. Take all of it, it'll, it'll just kind of 
brush it. You either pull it back down in the middle or just finish rolling it off to the side. And it looked just like a grader or a dozer's been down here. So that's a quarter of a mile road so far right there. We're gonna turn this camera off and we'll, uh, we'll see about hopping y'all around outside some that y'all watch. with the drag of wood over it and it's it's starting to take shape but i don't know if y'all noticed or not with the camera facing the wood in the back back here i was holding more to this side over here you want to hold more to this side and then more to this side going back and it kind of overlaps your strokes and it kind of pulls that weight especially the way i got that wood grabbed it pulls the wood the the dirt back up in the road and then with the first little bit of wood that's touching it, it acts like a grater blade pulling the dirt back up. And then the way it, the, the wood flares out in the back back here, anything that clumps up really heavy, it takes and just rolls it back off to the side and it just kind of, it recrowns your road. Yeah, a dozer would be easy here. Well, I say easy, a dozer, a road grader is what you need for this. Uh, and we do have a road grader and we have a dozer but they're not paying me to fix this road but to help my truck drivers come and go easier I got a skitter sitting there not doing a thing and I know how to do road work so yeah if y'all want me to have a dozer so bad I'll gladly take donations I mean I ain't picky it don't even gotta have air conditioner. <laughs> All right, y'all. The end of the video. You can see we moved, and uh, I don't think it was like 10 acres here. We'll be done quick. We're not gonna finish it today. We got pretty good fog. Got our quota in. We got 56 this week. <laughs> uh, corona, is that you? <laughs> uh, so we're just filling Michael up right now. He's on, he's taking his little lunch break. We fill him up during his lunch break and we don't gotta do it late this afternoon when it's time to go home. Mickey just got done catching up his drugs. He's cleaning up the set right now. Brady's out there running around on the rubber tire. Uh, got the track shooter shut down until we can figure out more on what's going on with it. Not sure where Matthew's running around and doing, but we're, uh, we're almost done with this little patch. I said it was like 10 acres. It ain't much. And Monday we got to go back to the place where we got the uh, the tracks. I almost stole off, off the track cutter where they tried to cut the track pads off. We got about a day there to finish up. We'll get that done, and then depending on what the rain's looking like next week, because it's supposed to rain next week, we'll uh, we're going to be going back to what we call the Vizard Road. It was a uh, I want to say it was like 300 and something acres of timber that we had in there to cut. Something like that. It was a lot. We got a lot left in there to get. and uh, I think we're fixing to wrap the day up anyway and go on to the house. But anyway, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. Hopefully y'all learned something and uh, 
enjoyed the skitter road building segment there if you didn't come back tomorrow we'll try something different <laughs> and uh anyway guys dude, thank y'all for all the support it, it means a lot as always and uh make sure you go subscribe for me if you're not subscribed and uh leave me a comment and hit that like button i gotta think about it sometimes yeah comment like subscribe three things y'all need to do if you're not doing it appreciate it a little bunch so anyway guys until the next video y'all leave me a comment let me know what y'all want to keep seeing what y'all want to see more of y'all want to see some more of this but that new john disc skitter huh? what about that skitter y'all want, want some more of that you want some loader action you want to go watch brady run around on the rubber tires go down in the comments let me know we'll uh we'll get it done maybe a week or two before you get to see it after you ask your question because we're that far behind those videos now that's good i like it like that i can plan stuff so anyway guys till the next video i'll catch y'all next time we're out of here